Hey guys, I'm Jen Ledger from the band Ledger and also the band Skillet and I'm here to tell you my favourite things. So let's get rolling. Favourite thing to do with your spare time? I don't get much time to do this, but I love to draw. I love art, I love sketching, I love painting, and I actually just released my own canvas art prints on Etsy. I love to draw about basically whatever's inspiring me at the moment, and usually it's when I'm reading the Bible, if there's a specific scripture that I feel like God's speaking to me, I'll uh, take the time to do a sketch to kind of help me remember it. One person you look up to and why? Corey Cooper from the band Skillet is a massive hero of mine. I got into Skillet when I had just turned 18 years old and I'd only become a Christian a year before. I was not only learning how to be a professional touring musician, I was also learning how to pay my bills, how to be an adult, and also how to live for Jesus. Corey Cooper really took me under her wing. If it wasn't for her, I wouldn't be the woman I am today. Favorite movie of all time. You guys aren't gonna believe me on this one, but my favorite movie of all time is Kung Fu Panda. I don't even feel ashamed. I think it's awesome. Jack Black is fantastic. It was actually like a really significant time for me. You know, Kung Fu Panda basically is a story about someone that is called to something that he's not great at. Uh, he's around other people that are way better at it than him. He looks up to these other people and he's like, you should do that. You're a hero. You're a warrior. I know the feeling of feeling like the responsibility in front of you feels too big for you. And uh, simply being yourself ends up being the way to have victory. What's your favorite Skillet song? Uh, my favorite Skillet song is a song called The Resistance, mainly because it just rocks so freaking hard. And it is so fun to play. Like anyone that knows Skillet, you should check that song out because it's got a wicked outro with really cool drumming that it's very fun for me. Favorite beauty product when you want to pamper yourself? I need a lot of under eye concealer because like I had two hours of sleep and I'm here like with all these cameras around me. So favorite podcast you're listening to? I listen to the Ask Pastor John podcast. I love how it's like any question ever. It's not just like Bible questions. John Piper is obviously someone that really knows the word, so I just super trust his answers. A go-to dinner recipe. I suck at cooking. I never buy groceries. I got home for two days and I went to Corey Cooper's house to borrow half and half because I'm so bad at this stuff. So my go-to dinner recipe, if I'm going to cook, is I get a crock pot, I slam loads of chicken in it, and then I put salsa all over it, and then I let it cook. What's your favorite Ledger song? My favorite Ledger song is a song called, well, first of all, completely, because it's brand new. Another song that is also my favorite would be a song called Not Dead Yet, because it came from a really dear place in my heart. There's a few years ago where I was struggling with fear and anxiety in a way that I'd never struggled with it before. And it was when I was praying about doing the Ledger Project and this started to happen and it made me feel convinced that if I am someone that struggles with such fear, I can't be a person that sings about God and uh, isn't you know, on a platform like that in front of other believers. It was a few years later after wrestling through that season, uh, I thought that I'd had victory over that because it was such an intense battle. I thought, surely I've won that. I'll never have to face that ever again. However, about a year later, I was on stage with Skillet and I was performing and I started to feel panic come into my heart. It left me feeling so incredibly defeated. And I came off stage and I talked to Corey Cooper and I just said, after all these years, I can't believe how many times I've fought this battle. What if this is something that never goes away for me? And she looked at me and she said, then you fight, Jen, while there's breath in your lungs and until the day that you die, you never stop fighting and you do not let fear rob you of your own life. And so I basically wrote the song Not Dead Yet about that. It's become my theme song because I think as Christians, we can feel like we've failed when we have to face the same fight more than once. But in actual fact, you haven't failed. We're just not in heaven yet. And we're gonna have to fight through things. Jesus says that many times in the Bible. It's okay if I'm broken. It's okay if I struggle, but I will fight and I will rise to my feet. And even if it makes me think I'm, I'm flawed, I can't do this, I'm a fraud. He's chosen me, he is with me, and he sees all of those things about me and he still wants to use me, and so that's why I stand up and do what I do. We have a mic that you can just drop. <laughs> <laughs>